a 21-year-old from India, recently finished her studies. Prableen Kaur Matharu's death has her family distraught. The whole village loved her. She spoke so softly and nicely. She was so beautiful, a natural beauty. Matharu is from the village of Chiti, near the city of Jalandhar in the Indian state of Punjab. Her parents saved up money to send her to school at Langara College, business studies. Her father says she's always been the top of her class. Where she went to school, she was coming in first. Her photo still hangs there on the main board. Her principal came over. She was the head girl in the school for girls. She was so intelligent. Matharu's body was found inside a home in this Surrey neighborhood. Police have provided few details of what actually happened, but we do know that Matharu's body was one of two found inside a home. And investigators have also confirmed that the woman's death appears to have been a homicide. And while her family mourns, so too does the entire community of Chiti. Everybody in, from our village, we have 40, 50 families here. Everyone is upset. Yes, That's so. just, just really, really sad news. Dollywal is a family friend of the Matharus. He says Prableen's mother already has a visa, but Gurdjol does not. He is waiting for papers to arrive from the RCMP to apply for an emergency visa. Told me that they are planning to take the body back home. They want to make funeral arrangements in, uh, in our village. That visa also holds the key to information surrounding their daughter's death. Dollywall says police informed the family of the death, but nothing else. He even contacted police himself to try and get some answers. Uh, I talked to him and uh, he said he cannot give any information. When his family will come, then we will share some information. In a tweet, I hit confirmed that the second body found in the house was an 18-year-old man from the Lower Mainland. The only clue for a family searching for answers. Joel Ballard, CBC News, Surrey.